Okay, so the shooting we just done, it covers a bunch of different drills, okay? The first, you saw shooting from here. Now, vehicles are something we all have in real life. They're all around, so we need to learn how to shoot from behind cover, okay? And so, um, what you saw was a little example of prone, kind of urban prone, where you're leaning down, um, your face is in the dirt, and also a little bit of supine when we're on our back and we're, we're moving through, looking through the under aperture. This is something we would uh, do, we had practiced in carbine two um, without the truck, you know. We, we don't want to shoot holes in a truck. All right, so from there, we stood up, we did a, a box drill, okay? And then we moved to an intermediate barrier. And here, this is where we practice um, kneeling, which is a very common shooting position. You know, we engage our targets, we moved through, you know, practicing safety rules, obviously. If we had been moving with our fingers on the trigger, could have had an accident, um, all that stuff. So the safety plays in every step of the way. Uh, from here, we did a standing position where we also did either a box drill or a failure drill. Okay. Um, and those are, those are drills that we teach in uh, carving one. All right, but we just build on them as we go, as you can see. And then from here, this is where we really get into um, the dynamics of foot placement while you're shooting. Um, if, you, if you play video games or you see movies on TV, uh, you know, the good guys are always running and shooting and getting their targets all the time. And in real life, it's, it takes a lot of practice to move your feet. If, um, if you have a weapon at home, you know, obviously take all the bulls out, bullets out. But if you just practice with your sights aligned on one thing and try to walk across a hallway, keeping your sights aligned on that object, you'll see how much your, your barrel is going to bounce up and down with every step. Okay, so that's what we wanted to work on here with this next drill with um, the little cones, okay, with the zigzag. So from here we had to practice turning and using your torso as a swivel while your, your legs are moving in one direction, your hips should be moving in the other, okay. That's uh, familiar to all you Halo players out there. Okay, so you turn. From here you gotta switch directions, you gotta get used to shooting this way as you're moving, you know, your foot placement's just right. And then from here, this is where we practice the uh, transition. You know, where you drop your rifle, you pull out your sidearm, and you engage your targets. So, those are all things that are covered. We cover the basics of it in Carbine 1, but Carbine 2, we build on it. Carbine 3, we would have more uh, team movements, more um, higher speed type stuff. So, this is all, this is what we do, you know, build on the basics.